Hello folks, this is me. Um you know if I'm just I'm just making that video to test my uh new Logitech 920 webcam and whatever I'm gonna say after that is just worthless. So if you're not interested in testing the voice and the picture quality of that webcam, don't really bother what I'm saying, you could totally just mute. Um so just to pass the time and see how efficient this camera is because sometimes it just loses focus and stuff I'm gonna start talking about um, let's just say array lists and hash maps and I've been having this little conversation with a friend of mine about the difference between a hash map and an array list and we found out that that array lists are way faster in taking inputs and giving out outputs uh, while hash maps are a little bit slower but what makes um, a hash map is more efficient is that the index of the values in the hash map can be any kind of object it can be a string it can be just a binary it can be integers it can be anything you want but on the array list the index have to be an integer and that's really cool because let's say you have a face detection system and um, you want to search information by face so you, you have a detection to the face and you want to search a database and you want to get some information retrieve some information from a database and you want to make the face as the index which is a picture and it can be turned into whatever kind of object you want, bitmap, whatever, GIF, or whatever you want. And you want to search by that, not by numbers, because you can't represent that face as a number. Then a good choice to use for that is going to be, I, I believe, to be hash maps. But, um, yeah, but but in case of array lists, I guess it's it's just something you want to do super fast for values that you want to store with an integer index so probably because most of my friends are basically people who have masters and PhD degrees in computer science what I'm saying right now is basically crap but as I told you it's just to, this whole video is just for uh, testing my camera and the voice that is coming through the camera uh, there's actually a lot of note that is worth talking about when you try to I'm recording this video directly through uh, YouTube upload uh, functionality and, and the first time when you give permission to that flash app to accelerate to have access to your uh, hardware the the, the uh, microphone and the webcam it, the, the record button doesn't really work I wonder if that's just a bug or I don't know just 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 a side note just thought I'd let people know about it and yeah that's about it I'm, I'm gonna have to review this video and just see the, the the video quality and and see how it works the good thing about this this Logitech camera 920 is that um, it it basically works even at night. So if if, if 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 the lights are out and it's nighttime and there is no light at all, you still can't be seen, which is pretty cool. The the price of that camera is also is is pretty accurate. It's in, in the ranges of a hundred and fifty under twenty dollars. Um, so yeah, it's, it works fine with Skype, works fine with all other applications. Then try it really with pictures. Uh, maybe because we already have cell phones and all these kind of different things that actually uh, captures the um, pictures more efficiently. So yep, that's about it. Thanks guys and uh, yep, thanks. Thank you.